Hi YouTube. Today I'm gonna do the switch from the 12 volt system into the 24 volt system. I already like unplugged all the old instruments, like these charge controllers. This one of course works. It just doesn't charge. I mean, it does not work. But this one could work. But I, I just don't know. I used it as a display to see where the battery was charged at, and I used to use it as well as like the um, outlet for the inverter so this is the new charge controller it's a hybrid between a solar and wind I don't know if I'm going to have a windmill yet I'm going to think about it this is the old controller I just unplugged it for safety reasons all the plugs while I'm plugging first unplug the panels go with first plus then minus and of course I each time uh, make sure to insulate them so they cannot touch otherwise you're gonna have a sparkly well let me let me call it this way you, you're gonna have an expensive spark All right, let me put this aside batteries too this is just the inverter it's not plugged in anything anywhere so I just left it like that so you see all battery um, these are the battery cables all of them It's insulated. So I'm go going to switch out, I guess, this one and, and this one to make the 12 volt that I have currently in parallel. I'm going to put them in series. All right. So here it is. <coughs> Done it. I have a uh, minus cable whoops well it's, well it's somewhat down there it's not important but I got one for minus I connected these two and I have one for plus and the axis um, you know slot on the minus and plus I just like you know insulate so now I'm gonna plug these into these controllers Hopefully it will work. So yeah, so I decided to hot glue these two here. I have to wait a moment. Um, I tested my controller. I can't tell if it's like really charging. The light is like lit. I remember it blinking, but I cannot confirm. <clears throat> I have a second one here which broke a while ago, but that was just due to, um, you see, um, last year when I had like my panels, the setup was different, and one time, I guess the rain hit it, and so it rusted inside or something. So I tested this one to see if it works, and um, this one doesn't light up at all. This one, as you can see, it lights up. It just like, I can't tell when I plug in the panel if it's charging or not, because it's lit. I remember it blinking, but how can I test that now? <clears throat> I will get an, another one of these anyway, because they're fairly good and they're um, cheap. You can get these ones for around like a I think 35 euros or 40 euros on eBay this guy you'll be able to sometimes get for like 65 euros plus shipping 70 euros depends on the time on eBay so um, while we're waiting I can show you again uh, oh this is what I wanted to show you. I picked this up. I'm gonna uh, just for you know for having the outside maybe cell phone charging or like a little fan going on in here. I'm gonna plug it in, into this. I'm not gonna have three controllers sitting there anymore since I have the display with this one. Um. So this is going to be enough. Here I'm going to plug in the. Uh, 
one of my inverters. The other one I'm gonna hook up later. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm running with it while I'm like after I'm done with this. So as you can see, I wanted to show you it's a 24 volt 30 amp. That's why I'm going with 24. Two I bought it specifically, so I'm very happy. I mean, so far I will see in I guess like an hour when everything runs and see how how it does. So I plugged in the batteries. Well, the battery first, of course. Always plug in the battery first, and then the um, panels. And last, I would um, plug in the um, load. Always go minus plus, minus plus. Um, here, if you look now, this time I've done a little better job. I don't want the wires to be too exposed, so I insulated them, put them deeper. I did so here. Uh, <laughs> for all of you close watchers, yes, I I do know I have these switch. That's that's what it was like. I have a marking here that identifies it. I have written there on the other side, like with red. Anyway, so it seems to charge. It seems to, I'm I'm very happy. I can browse, I guess, for here. To know what this all does I'm going to find out this is a pretty neat inverter the best I got so far and it's fairly cheap like I said if you go out now you can get this one I guess for like around seventy dollars with shipping if you're lucky you get a little under if you're unlucky you have to pay a little more it's a buy now um, for 150 euros so let me plug in the load and see. So this is it. It's plugged in. Um, playing around with the options. I don't know if it's charging or not. I can't tell. It's um, kind of frustrating. I'm clicking for the options. I see the battery um, voltage, which seems to be going up so I don't know if it's because of this or that or it's doing something right now so I'm very happy about that <laughs> it's just like I really am confused like I'm trying to um, start my inverter and I'm just not getting to it I, I don't know why it's, I thought it was the cables or something I don't know I gotta wait a little, see what's up with that. So, yeah, this is it. I mean, I hope you guys uh, learned a little. And, or, or, well, not necessarily learned, but I hope it helped to do your own systems. With your own, like, little apartments or houses. It's very, fairly easy, as you see. And, um, uh, yeah, I guess this is it. I'm gonna clean up here. Maybe I do an update video on, um, you know, the charge controller, how it works. If I'm like, you know, if I figured out the inverter problem, I wanted to show you guys anyway, like my uh, inverter that I have currently um, plugged in. I have two inverters, but I only have one right now plugged in. Uh, here. Oh, here. You see, these instructions are a little bit um, frustrating. There's only one page. The other one is in German, but it's like a Denglish. It's a Deutsch English. <laughs> so it doesn't help. By the way, maybe I find something online. I'll check. Uh, maybe the uh, maybe the manufacturer or something to say. Yeah, take a look at this. They're charging. Oh, I didn't twist those. It's my <coughs> little ones. I am not gonna keep the piggy and the cow on those cans. I figured out they're just fine. Two of them I won't have on cans. I'll see. 
Okay, take care. Bye.